Right, Monday morning. Starting the day off, we were cleaning there. Just wanted to get the place freshened up. Now, yesterday I ended up eating a heap of sweets, heap of sugar. Woke up this morning with nearly like a, what felt like a hangover. So, just want to kind of get the whole thing fresh, get myself fresh, and just get the week started. Um, going to have we have three pieces to do today. We have first thing is a back squat building up to a heavy single, 15 minute arm wrap, then after that, with rowing thrusters and bar muscle ups. We'll just have to see how the bar muscle ups go because my hand's still raw a wee bit from the weekend. So, we'll see how that feels whenever we get there. Maybe we'll change that out for something else. And then the last piece then is just running, it's like six rounds of 400 meter run and 20 GHD setup. So, we'll get uh, started with the back squats first of all. Right, that's the back squat done. Built up to just 140 there. I think my one rep max. Actually, my one rep max is 153. I actually rate them on the belt. So the last time I did that was in 2022, 14th to the 11th, 2022. I'd say my back squat rate. <laughs> if I got a kilo on my back squat for every time I says that I'm a bad back squatter, I'd probably have a good back squat. But uh, 140, I just found myself that last rep, you seen yourself, I was like leaning way forward and I was like nearly getting my hips up and then lifting it in my back, so just call it as that for the day. So back squatting done, right, we're getting this thruster workout now. Now even taking that barbell whenever I was warming up is sore, so I might just tip it up and see what happens when I get these bar muscle ups. Um, so aye, right, next one, we'll get into the workout. Right, so next workout now is 15 minute arm wrap, 40 calorie row, 20 thrusters, 10 bar muscle ups, 15 minute arm wrap. Right, that's that finished. Um, I ended up getting two rounds and 60 reps, so just finished the thrusters in the third round. Pat. Damn. Nice and steady on the row. 
when I got the thrusters in unbroken on the thrusters bar muscles have broke in the six and four now my plan was if I'd have got back to the thrusters in the third round to just hang on and go for unbroken to a ten or as many as I could in the remaining time but I think I might have just pissed the row them rounds a wee bit too slow and then that uh, didn't give me much time at the end I think I could probably do three rounds that if I wanted to hurt as a man says but I didn't bother wanting to hurt today Right, that's that done. Now we have a heap of run under it. Right, so this workout, there's six rounds of 400 meter runs and 20 GHD setups. Now, I'm gonna swap and put on a pair of running shoes because there is a lot of running. Um, but see these ones here, they're uh, Hoka's. That's the name of them, right? Now, when I got these at the start, I was like, they are the worst shoe I ever put on my foot. I did not like them one, but thought they were absolutely rubbish. Thought they were like a wee Instagram shoe, like, oh, cool pair of hookahs. And I still think they're a bit of a poser shoe, to be honest, but I don't know much about running, but I'm starting to warm them a wee bit. I think maybe the more I break them on, they get a bit more comfortable or whatever, but they're nothing. Now, these hookahs, right, are nothing compared to these. See, a Asics shoe. Unbelievable. I've had these here. They've done marathons, they've done half marathons, they've done Ironmans, they've done Ballyleaf and Coastal Challenges, they've done every running workout I ever did. And here, um, they've done work about the house. They're just the greatest fucking shoe I ever put on my foot. And one day I was in here and I was actually doing a running workout with rope climbs, and then I ended up ripping them. Just like that, look. Right. So they've, they've, they've gone past their, their use by date, they're, they're done, but, for me, anyways, Asics all the way. Hoka, I feel poser shoe. Asics, a dog and out shoe. Pup for the path, dog for the road. Now again, that's just my opinion. Like you might have a pair of Hokas and love them. That's good. I hope you're happy in them. Me personally, I just don't. I just don't really like them that much. But seeing as I bought them, I'll not waste them. So I'll use them for this workout. I'll tell you one thing, hey, we are so lucky to have a run like this right outside the gym door. Like this place, and down through Swans Park, it's just a credit to the town. It does some job, and especially on a day like this, so lucky to have it. Right, last 20 GHDs, and that's us. Awesome. Folks, that's the workout done. Um, it's a wee bit late actually, because I had to do the. Um, workout after the 10 o'clock class I was farting about this morning taking my time and kind of feeling half sorry about myself with a sugar hangover so it took a wee bit longer than I expected um, but that's us now home time and we will see you tomorrow for the next one good luck